uh, B5 S4 so in regards to hitting a curb crashing with this side uh, and uh, the alignment being all out of whack a uh, quick glance reveals the following look at that adjustment screw you see how it's bent out of shape it's moved around and it has some like over there there's some shavings uh, I don't know if the alignment guy did that if he did he's an idiot um, I think it's from the impact and they just didn't they just basically aligned the front and you know set the toe collect the dough let it go um, but I believe that's the camber adjustment over there and this is the toe adjustment it moves the wheel inner and outer so if you look on the other side I've got a little bit of a shift there you see how it's it's moved but up top the subframe bolt or not the subframe bolt whatever that bolt is the toe adjustment bolt if we look at it from underneath you're gonna lay flat that bolt is perpendicular now if I look on this side that same bolt is pushing that way I don't know if I can catch it in the in the computer in the phone but even this bushing you look at this bushing and it's it's straight and then this bushing is actually flexing it's like twisting because this bolt is just putting a lot of pressure on it so um, I'm gonna yeah somebody's somebody's been there because that thing had a wrench on it I don't know if they try to adjust it or what but this this can't be right I mean it's not even in the it's not even flushed so I'm gonna well I'll let you make the call if you want me to try and bring this back to where it was and see what happens I haven't driven the car yet because um, it's been just puking oil everywhere but now that's fixed and there's actually another thing I wanted to show you and that is these upper control arms I'm not sure if this is normal or not these boots just sort of hanging out and grease shooting everywhere this side is not too bad but if you look on the other side that's just completely trashed so I mean it's got these I don't know it doesn't look good it doesn't I mean there's no play in it so maybe leave them until they start to get some play in them and then get rid of them <laughs> uh, but yeah I just wanted to make a note of that so right now we're all clean underneath now I haven't taken it to the car wash yet I, I'm still gonna pressure wash everything because all the rubber bits are coated in oil and that's not good but so far it's back together and running